You ready? You ready? You ready? You ready? You ready? Oh boy! Wordy word problem. One half of a number is more than. Oh, ha 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 ha! Is one more than one third of the same number. What's the number? The first thing I want to do is find that equal sign. So let's take some time and find that thing. All right, one half of a number is one more than one third of the same number. What's the number? One half of a number is one more than one third of the same number. Typically when you see this, is, is the equal sign. Oh boy. So to cut our work in half, what I have to do is translate the left side, then worry about the right side. Ha <laughs> One half of a number is one more than yeah, that's how it goes. So to the left of the equal sign, one half of a number. That's one half of a number. I'm just going to use N. You can use any letter you want. You could even use the first letter of your name. So, um, one half of a number is. I'll put the equal sign there. And then, uh, one third of the same number is one more than one third of the same number. Is one more than one third of the same number. Is one more than one third of the same number. Let's go finish him. Now, what can I do? I can back that math up or I can clear the fractions. Either way, either works. It's all good. Aye. Let's clear the fractions so that I don't have to worry about that. All right, so how do I do that? Then I multiply both sides by the common denominator. What's the common denominator of all the denominators? I see six, six, six. So I go and I whoop, multiply. Now, six divided by two is three. And then this one goes yeah, and this one goes yeah. Okay, so that's six over three, which is two. And then, and six times one, uh, six, six. So now I go and back that math up. I wanna get all my ends on one side. Yeah, gotta get ends. Like and subscribe. All right, there we go. Um, this is N here, and on the other side, I got six, six. So what's the freaking number? Six! <laughs> Woo! Box and flower. <laughs>